As the fight against COVID-19 continues, countries are strengthening measures to end the pandemic. However, the need for enough personal protective equipment for frontline workers is necessary. In this light, the former lawmaker deemed it necessary to support one of the busiest hospitals in the country. Babukar M. A. Sen received the items on behalf of the hospital. Um, her support here, especially the PPEs, as the personal protect protective equipment and the sanitary items, uh, will boost the morale of our staff and will also help to protect our staff. Uh, from um, from this disease. We know that uh, COVID-19 is contagious, uh, so the masks, the gloves, these are the things that we need. But when you send somebody to the battlefront to fight an enemy, it's important that you equip that individual. So the masks that are donated, uh, the gloves, you know, will really ensure that our staff have the requisite protective gears for them to do their work safely and go back to their families safely. COVID-19. We have heard of how it is devastating lives and livelihoods in countries around the world and knowing no boundaries. The Gambia is of course no exception. As we have reported a number of confirmed cases in the Gambia and one death. We must not let this situation escalate and must therefore do everything humanly possible to fight what has become a pandemic. We do know that by regularly and thoroughly cleaning of our hands with soap and water for 20 seconds or using alcohol-based hand sanitizer, can kill the virus. Six years ago, the Accident and Emergency Ward of Carnifin General Hospital was named after the former National Assembly member. Since then, she has been supportive to the hospital. Reporting for Paradise TV News, Jenna Bajabate.